Hey, this is Scott. <laughs> and this is Jay. And this is the Scott and Jay Show. And it is Friday, January the Friday. 18th. Friday. Yes. And it's 21 degrees outside. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <All right>. Jay. <laughs> this is so cute. There's our little... Uh, okay. We're just, we're just going to roll with it here. Yes. Hey, that was, that was cool. That was cool. Yeah, it was Lee Groff Olsen with the Barbersville Symphony, or yes. our special guest, Weather Girl. Mm-hmm. Weather Girl. Weather Girl. Salute. <laughs> Salute. So thanks for the record player, and I'll get it back to you. Lee brought this uh, record up to... That's really cool. It's a USB turntable print record from the USB uh, MP3 file. See ya. Bye. So, while we're on the subject of symphony, just real quick, this weekend at the Barbersville Symphony Orchestra, playing at the Barbersville Community Center, 7.30 Saturday, Mendelssohn Mashup. It's going to be a great time. You're going, you and your wife. And, uh... What is that? Saturday at 7.30. We have... So, so what's your posh voice? Wait. What's your posh voice on that? What's the, uh, yes, that's gonna be. No, that's, oh, 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 no, no, right. Uh, we're gonna go, and it's just gonna be a delight all evening. <laughs> mm, yes. So, uh, yeah. And then we're gonna scoff at the people that fall asleep. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, yes. Uh, and Starbucks will be there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and they will be there. So we're, I'm using this, uh, I bought this refillable Starbucks cup. I don't know how much it costs. Good for you. And so you get like 10 cents off each refill or whatever. It's like a dollar, I think, isn't it? Uh, you know, I forgot to even ask, but... I think it should be free to your folks. I would ask them, but the line's so long, I don't want to yeah, interrupt, interrupt the flow. So, uh... I'm going to do birthdays real quick just to get that out of the way because I haven't had any birthdays yeah. all week. You haven't had a birthday in like months. So hey, Jason, yeah. Jason Falls, happy birthday. Hey! Uh, Jim McTiernan, old college buddy friend of mine. And Saturday, Stephen Graham, hey, local yeah. artist, local teacher, local all-around great guy. Yes. How about you? Or did I, I, uh... I, I, I... <laughs> so Tim... I've got uh, Tim, breakfast, yeah. I've got coffee, mm-hmm. I've got my... Ipad out. So your Tim and Mateo. What's a Tim Teo? Tim Manti Teo. Manti Teo. Tearing so, up the news. Okay, so this, I'm confused. So I don't have any birthdays today. Oh. Wow. Yeah. I'm stumped with a birthday anywhere in the U.S. Uh, there is one tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> my cousin, my cousin Kim Gavlet Stewart. Uh, her birthday is so, tomorrow. Okay. Uh, Stephen Graham's birthday's tomorrow. Yeah, we said that. And uh, let's see, uh, Jill Martin's birthday's today, uh, tomorrow. Uh, Becky uh, Slack's birthday's tomorrow. Kyle Branson, Laura uh, Jones, and my cousin uh, Tanner. His birthday is All right. Sunday. Sally. So, yeah, so there's a few stumps. Um, my, my daughter's birthday's coming up Tuesday, so. There's a whole lot of us out there. You guys, uh, you guys and anyway, depends on if they owe you money and you don't like them. I'm not related, but if you like them and they don't owe you money, yeah, we're related. So, Tim, uh, Mato Tim. Manti Teo. Manti Teo. Um, yes. So, was his girlfriend. Did he really have a girlfriend? But or, or this lady was real. That's but the confusing. Was, that's the confusing thing of it. So the the the, the story the actually did exist, but I don't, so I don't know. I, yeah, exactly. I Everybody's the saying the same thing. It's like what the. So either he fell in love with this person on the internet, and they were playing a trick on him, and so to end it, they killed her off, and she's really not dead, but she at the same time really doesn't exist, but does exist. Um, and then there's uh, the I'm sure everyone else is as confused as I am, so I don't feel so that bad. He, he, they've drummed all of this stuff up to make him look a little bit more sane than, than the insane that he already is. And uh, that, that they've created this whole backstory of this been a horrible hoax on Manti Teo. But the, the speculation is that he may have created the story uh, in order to drum up... Um, Sympathy votes for the uh, the Heisman Trophy. Good job. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, so that's, no wonder that's awesome. I didn't understand. That's not like anybody else does either. No, no. So, uh, speaking of lies, um, one of my heroes, um, I'm, I'm still having a hard time with this, uh, Lance Armstrong. Oh, Lance Armstrong. You know, I... Lies, lies, lies. Oh, I, 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 don't, I still don't see him in the same aspect that I see, like, uh, you know, Pete Rose or... Michael Jordan. Uh, no, not Michael Jordan. No. Michael Jordan's a saint, so don't, don't, don't talk bad about Michael Jordan. Um, um, <laughs> who else was uh, kind of uh, in the doghouse? Uh, John Rose. Edwards. I don't see him as bad as John Edwards. See, here's the thing, is, is that, you know, when, whenever you've had a stuff go on and you have to take some of those medicines uh, you know it, it's I'm torn because it, do you have the, the purity of the whole entire sport and therefore he can't compete because he doesn't have it in him to do it um, but yet does he take what he can to get him to the same level as everybody else um, and, and he said that you know, it, it, somebody said this morning on the news, it's kind of like saying if you get pulled over by the police for driving five miles over the speed limit and just saying, well, I was speeding because everybody else is speeding. That's kind of his excuse. And I'm still, I'm still up in the air about it. I still like him. But, uh, you know, the more and more I hear about it, the worse that he sounds. And so I've got to drop that whole thing. Yeah. I don't, don't like really him. care. I don't. Well, he's kind of ruined now the Olympics. I heard the Olympics are even thinking about getting rid of the whole cycling event over this whole thing. If it's as tainted as everyone says it is, then... So anyway, I think they're going to get rid of the whole Olympic game if they're concerned with steroid use. Yeah. <coughs> so it's, it's a different world. You know, we've got the uh, steroid use in baseball. and we just need stand-up people. They just need... Good we need, we integrity. need uh, integrity, yes, definitely. Integrity in sports, integrity in, in it all. So, speaking of uh, lies, so, or oh, not lies, but speaking of integrity, you're not going to lie about uh, your weight when we weigh in next Wednesday, are you? We got, yes, the, we got the challenge going on. We're going to weigh in next Wednesday, and our goal now is to, or my goal, is to make sure Jay doesn't weigh, doesn't weigh any uh, less than I do. Which was, we're right there. I mean, so let me let me just show you. Do we need to bring the scales down here to actually take a picture? So we we sure might we might have to, to but I'm not uh, sure how Starbucks. I don't know that, that we can weigh in like we normally weigh in because <laughs> uh, I, you know, okay. So there is a little bit yeah, of a sheet. I little. don't weigh in the same way I do at the doctor. Um, so at the doctor, oh, yeah. I just take my coat off. Right. Right. At you get home, your keys, your phone, your yeah, shoes. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's a few more other items that come off when like I Your wait. backpack. Oh, yeah. Um, your snow skis. Yes. And your, and your babushka. Do you ever take your babushka off at me? the doctor's office when you weigh? No. No, no. Look right there. Look how many pounds I've lost. Yeah, 27, 28. That's pretty incredible. Yep, but this is the number that you're at right now. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. What's up? How much are you all right? Yeah, how about you? Really well. Good. So, so, and next Wednesday when we next weigh Wednesday, in, yes. the goal is for me to weigh less than Jay, and of course Jay wants to weigh less than me. Happen. I'm gonna be We're right there at the under. same number, so there you have it. So my, my goal for the end of January, is uh, to, to have lost 35 pounds. Oh, wait. So if I hit, so at the end of January, if I hit 35 pounds, do you realize what that means? I'm halfway to my goal. So on Wednesday, that's really good. That's incredible. That's clothes. Should, you should be like have, finding new clothes in your I, new, new belt holes I'm, I'm using today, and, and I put my coat on. I was like, holy cow, I've got a lot of room in there now. <laughs> so... So whoever wins next Wednesday has to buy the other the other's possible. Okay. Yeah. So there we go. There's the challenge. That's good. Follow along, follow along with us on Facebook. See us on Twitter, Scott and Jay Show, Scott and Jay, Jay Show on Facebook, and of course the YouTube channel, Scott and Jay Show. So it's pretty simple. 
Yeah, yeah. So, all right. So here's here's Thank your you tip right of the day. So if you're going through a drive-through, here's what you want to make sure you do first: is when you 